hello family welcome to my channel this is mimi Leda tv thank you so much guys for clicking so today i am taking you through how i build my three shops in front of my house so guys as you can see during the december period we were in ghana together with all the family we had nice time so we had to put this part of the work on pause because we didn't want any distractions from um the children not having a good time in ghana so yeah after the holiday there we go again with all the works so yes i've been posting shots right in there but uh, yeah the thing is i have not get time to be able to upload my videos so now i am coming to some point so i feel like this is the right time to upload a video for you guys so guys if you are new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and join the family for more exciting videos to come so as you can see this is the beginning of january we started this so we um, the guys came and then they had to fill the ground because we still uh, we still use the inside there for burning our garbage during the festive season so after that they had to clear everything and then voila they did the concrete on the ground and then they started with the block work so this is day two of what they have done so yes guys as you can see there is still container over there um beginning of my brother being in the house he was using the container in front for his work as a small office for himself because he's into um, building projects also so he used that small container in front for his prep for his office yes so yeah he's into swimming pool building and all those kind of stuff so if you want someone that can build your swimming pool for you i will leave his contact below so you can hit cyrus up and he's always there to help you get the best for your swimming pool he is the one that did my pool for me and he will make sure that you get the best of all time what you want for your house so yes as you can see this is the time that he was busy with the corners to make the uh, to make the corners for the guys for the concrete yes yeah, so he was busy with the wood and they were also busy with the block work so this is the two shops they are busy with now because the container is still there and soon they will have to take the container out and my guava tree yes so this guava tree there I, um, my kids enjoyed the guava a lot when we were in Ghana in December and they had a we all had a very good time but now I feel so sad that my guava tree have to go but yeah I don't have any choice because where it ended is in the uh, it's at where the shops have to come so we have a plan for three shops in front and th that is exactly what you are going to see here so after they finish raising up these two then they are going to break off the container and then they are going to start with the side of where the container is also so guys uh, at this part i am going to have to talk about uh, how the project of my brother is going yes so if you want him to supervise your swimming pool for you or you have a building project in ghana that you want a supervisor someone that can be trustable to take care of the project for you you can easily contact him and he will be right there to help to check your work for you the the um exact materials to be used and what have to be done on the project he's always there for advice and everything so yes I'll, i as i said i'll leave his contact below so that you can contact him and get to know him or yes for your project to be done by him so this is how far we have come with a block laying day three already they rose up the sites so we had two shops already rose up yes and i have posted a video just recently about my land that i'm selling in kaswa yes i have um it's it's more than 20 to uh, 22 plots that we have that is been on sale so if you anyone wants to buy a land just check my other videos you can view the land by yourself i got i have put three um war on three plots so the rest there are for sale so if you want to have one for yourself just hit me in the comment section and i'll i'll gladly answer you or i'll leave my 
you can get my number in my comment section and then yeah hit me up and then let me give you the price and you can also become a owner or a house owner so guys yes the day four already as you can see my brother is walking to the front of the house to show me what's next what we have to do so now as you can see this is the front view of where the container was they have taken the 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 shade that we did in front for the container they took it out so the only thing that have to be done now is they have to cut the under the container and then take it off yes so that is a gift for my brother's girlfriend he took it or uh, she wanted to use it sorry i said he <laughs> she wanted to use it so i have to uh yeah she took it and then she is going to open something nice with it and uh, yeah she's happy with it so guys as you can see from here the back of the walls everything was superbly done and then now we are going to start taking the container out so yes this is when the container finally arrived in the house so we had uh, four guys which is the workers and my brother and some other two guys that helped they carried the whole container from the front view into the house and they did a great job so this is how far we are now after the container was gone this is how the place was looking like a bit messy but not too long because the next day already concrete started and then block work was done so guys i am going to take you through the shop everything is completed now but i'm going to post this video first to show the first uh, the step by step of what we did and how far we have come and the part two of the video is coming to show how we did the concrete on top of the house or on top of the on top of the shops and also yeah the part three is coming how we plastered the whole shop and everything so i am going to post this video back to back for now i'm not going on break anymore because i have now a lot of things to post yes so if you have any question in the comment section please don't forget to leave a comment and let me reply you whatever you want to ask of just leave a comment and if i don't know if i'm the only one how building materials have been so expensive now in these days guys if anyone that is building in ghana and want to discuss about how things are the inflation is affecting everything in ghana if you want to discuss about it please leave a comment let's know your mind what is going on how you see things also please let us know and share your thoughts also in the comment section so guys if you are new to this channel you are very very welcome and thank you so much guys for clicking and being with this channel till this day yes so this is how far we are as you can see the late the guys are now busy with filling inside and then the next day already we are ready to go so yeah with, during this process my swimming pool was empty because i have a reservoir tank under um just close to the swimming pool so um i have to empty that play, the swimming pool because the dust and everything was just too much for the water so i have to do make it empty so this corner here will be um a storage for my things that i'll be using in the swimming pool uh, but for the swimming pool yes so i have a small storage already but i i feel like the corner there is not of any use so i'm going to make another small storage there for my pipe holes and other stuff that i'll be keeping for the swimming pool yes so this is how far we are so if you have watched the video till this this um place please thank you so much and don't forget to share subscribe and comment to my channel thank you so much and i see you in the